Oh, dude. I'm sorry. The Xbox is shot. I guess we can't have game night tonight. Mm. Have you tried burying your Xbox in the ancient Indian burial ground? <laughs> <laughs> what? Have you tried burying your Xbox in the ancient Indian burial ground? Dude, I heard you. I just don't understand. What's not to understand? You take something that's broken, bury it in the ancient Indian burial ground. Next day, it's as good as new. And that really works? That sounds unethical. Yeah, man. <laughs> it does. My phone had a crack in it last week. I buried it in an ancient Indian burial ground. Now, it looks great. Does it work good? I mean, my phone bleeds and yells Hail Satan a lot. Dude, that's the opposite of working good. <laughs> Yo, uh, any good news on the video games? Nah, man, my Xbox is busted. Oh, word. Uh, have you tried burying it in an ancient Indian burial ground? <laughs> Christine, you too? That's terrible. Oh. I'm sorry, an ancient Native American. <laughs> no, that's not better. What you guys are doing is totally dark. I thought that too at first, but the results don't lie. My bike got a flat tire, I buried it in an ancient Indian burial ground, and now it rides like a dream. And there are no like weird side effects. I mean, four dead cat bodies showed up next to my bike the other day, but it's just a coincidence. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Christine, your bike totally killed those cats! No, you really think so? Oh, uh, yeah, I really think so. Look, Jesus, I don't understand why you guys just don't get your shit fixed. Some of us aren't made of money, Taylor. Yeah, Taylor, it would have cost me $75 to get my tire fixed. But with the ancient Indian burial ground, it just cost me swearing my allegiance to a dark lord who would promise to spread the blood of the innocent. I didn't have to spend a dime. It's a great deal, man. No! No, that's not a great deal! We're trying to help you, and you're just shitting on our ideas. <laughs> yeah, Taylor, maybe we should bury your attitude in the ground. You wouldn't be such a downer. Because, you know, if we buried my attitude in an ancient Indian burial ground, it would come back with eight legs, breathing fire, and, you know, with a hankering for human flesh. At least you'd be more open when your friends are trying to help. Yeah. Give me a minute. Ha! Ah, jeez. <laughs> No, we're just having the worst conversation ever, and we're not playing video games because my Xbox is busted. <laughs> Have you tried? Yeah! If you say burying my Xbox in an ancient Indian burial ground, I'm gonna go off. <laughs> no, <laughs> that's absurd. I'm gonna <laughs> suggest the guy down the street. He's really good with electronics. Oh, cool. Yeah, yeah. He totally saved my ass when my PlayStation's on the fritz. Dude, he sounds like he's good at his job. <sighs> Ever since he got resurrected from that ancient Indian burial ground, <laughs> he had electronics no problem. Oh yeah, you give me up for a <laughs> No, no. Everybody get the fuck out of my I house. Just, yeah, get the fuck out of my house. I don't care. Y'all are messed up. No, this is evil shit now. And let's do it. Get out. Don't do it. God. Ancient Indian burial grounds fucked up. <laughs> Monkey paws the way to go! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>